It is Hispanic Heritage Month, and with it begins a project that won't just last for a few weeks, but all year long. Local Latina artist Yancy Villacavo is here to tell us more about Hispanic Heritage Month and this special thing that we're launching at Latino Memphis, a gallery, yes. essentially, a gallery right. space that will be used throughout the year, right? Right. That's so cool. Yeah, it's um, they they moved to this new space and they has it's, it's a pretty open area and it's beautiful. So um, we decided to, well, they decided to do this gallery, this mm -hmm. wall, so we can display Hispanic art throughout the year. That's so awesome. doing something like this, Yancy, why is it so important not only to the Latino community here in the Memphis area but the entire community as a whole? Yeah, that's exactly what you mentioned. That's um, what Latino Memphis does. They bring people together mm -hmm. right so art always brings people together um, and I believe the more you know about somebody or somebody's culture the more respect and the more tolerance you have um, you know for that culture for that person so Latino Memphis is trying to um, to bring that art piece into their education area that makes so much sense and let's let's show a few pieces of your art and tell us what I guess the word is informs your art. Where do you get your inspiration? Especially from? the picture that we're looking at right yeah, here. Yeah, that's beautiful. Yes, um, that is one of my old pieces. Um, normally, I get um, inspiration from just simple scenes, simple things, and ordinary pe people from my beautiful country, Mexico. Mm -hmm. um, I do take pictures and work from photographs or uh, from memory. Mm -hmm. So when you go back home, you actually, do you, you go on scouting trips or what do you call them? Um, yeah, I mean, um, like for instance, I just made a trip to Chihuahua this summer with the kids and, um, and I, I shoot several uh, you know, pictures, and we went to Guadalajara, mm -hmm. so they, there are different areas of the country, and they're totally different, and, you know, you always see people walking, <laughs> yeah. doing things, and, yeah. and I just, you know, shoot people and try How to. How long, though, does it take you to actually find that image that you really, really like? Is that a, uh, an extremely difficult process for Oh, you? yes. Yeah, I mean, it's like, I should normally have, like, I brought about 2,000 pictures, and wow. to decide <laughs> on a good image and maybe crop and things, right. that's the most difficult part for me. When I, we were just looking at one with the, the boat. Man, mm -hmm. I love that piece of work. I always think of Mexico particularly as vibrant colors and very alive, and a lot of your work reflects a lot of color. Is that just, a, there it is, there's the beautiful picture. Uh, yes. It is. Uh -huh. Is that just a uh, misnomer that we have or a stereotype that is not true, or is vibrant color a big part of Mexico, in Mexican culture? It is definitely a big part of Mexican culture. Um, the vivid color is very bright. Uh, it is it is part of the culture and you know it just it's in me so every time that I paint it just comes out and yeah. I, sometimes I try to do more of the you know new colors mm -hmm. don't do that and they just <laughs> they just keep coming back so I just and we're you glad know, it's they in do. me yeah <laughs> before just we have to wrap up it's again, just a lot of people are going to be wondering where can they come out to see all of this artwork well, everybody's invited uh, to the opening reception at Latino Memphis. And, um, that's the, Thursday, right? That's this Thursday from the opening reception from 5 to 7.30. But the exhibition will be on the, uh, the October 25th. Excellent. There's the address on the screen. And you keep that address in mind because throughout the year, throughout time, there will be different Hispanic artists featured. So we're so glad you were the first yes, one. Yes, we are. Yes. Cool. yes. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. Thanks glad so to have you. All right.